Howdy everybody, this is Arlen Woods back at you again with Retro Styles. I hope your whole week's been awesome. It's Saturday. Hope you guys feel refreshed and I really hope you guys like my Flashback Fridays. You notice that I don't do any commentating like I usually do in the videos. It's just me playing some solid gameplay just so that way you guys can get a real feel for the game. Because I only do like the one level synopsis of the games. I hope you guys enjoy those as well. But I wanted to make a Flashback Friday kind of flashbacking to the retro gaming kind of like what I do but it's like almost a full spectrum it gives you two full worlds if not more just depends on how long I feel like playing really but it's pretty awesome so if you guys can I'll put a link in the description below for the flashback Friday you guys let me know what you guys thought about that today we're here to check out the sword of Zolan on a Google Play market it's a remake of uh, Ghosts and Goblins, Ghouls and Goblins, that whole series. And it's 8 bit or 16 bit. I mean, it can be both, but it's pretty awesome. Let's check it out. Alright everybody, here we go with the Sword of Zolan, pretty awesome game, and like I said, I'll have the link below down for that in the Google Play Market. Alright, tap the start button, Adventure, Act 1, okay you can see I've already gone through 6 acts, but for the sake of gameplay, I'm going to take you through a couple of them, okay I've already defeated them. Once there was a village full All of right. joy and happiness. I'll let you go and through night, this. The sound of flames surrounded the land. Pretty awesome. Look at the way uh the master of See look at just like the ghouls and ghosts and seized. ghosts and goblins. Out of nowhere. Pretty sweet. Look at that. Gandalf. The village showed up. A face to face awesome. challenge was taking a place. Unfortunately, Tulbi could not stand against Lorzandar's dark spells. And fell on his knees. But then, when the sun rises upon the mountains, up. you, it's you, a hero. Up, you hero. Swing your sword once more, so because the adventure awaits you. Here we go. All right. So it's gonna show you how to play. I'm just gonna skip ahead because I already know how. See, so look right here. It tells you to jump. And you look. You can double jump by tapping the arrow twice. Okay. For those of you that are curious, you look. Double jump. On how to play, here we go. Oh, you want to collect all the money you can. You can see in the upper left hand, I'm sorry, upper right hand corner that I have 525 monies. Okay, look it. Defeat the enemy, just like this guy. Look. Boom, defeated him. Okay. Okay, that would have been one. Okay. And I already got the money box, that's where that would have been. Scroll down, swipe down, sorry, swipe down, swipe down again, and then get this little guy right here. And I don't need the heart, so you can't collect it. But I do need that, because watch, when I cast the fireball, you see that little gray fireball looking thing? Kabloom, 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 and give me one to replace it. Now, it doesn't do that all the time, but sometimes it does. You want to jump twice? Okay, and right here is perfect. Walk through the wall because sometimes that's where the secrets are at. Okay, here we go. There's one. And jump again. Or it's always a bit of a challenge. Double jump. Yes. Okay. Jump again. Go. Okay, there's a question mark right there. So we'll yes. see why. Because there was somebody in the wall. It's lucky time. I already saved them. Oh, can't land on the spikes, obviously. How are you gonna get up there? Let's go right here. Right here. I'm gonna try to collect all the money though. This money's important. Okay. It's like this guy, look, boom. If it's on the spike, okay, points 335. 
going to go home. Oh, I've got to love these ads. Noob and pro. got to love these ads. All right. Okay, so since I showed you those, I'm going to show you what the advanced levels look like. Okay, I'm going to go to level 7 and show you the difference between the intermediate and the pro. This gets hard. Where you can find it, everything. Okay. I like the way it pops up again too, pretty cool. Come on, you bee. Please, you don't watch out. See, look. It just gets harder. You gotta love these advertisements. Look at that guy. I love these advertisements. The advertisements are my favorite. What's going on here? No time to explain. All right, X out. All right. Take that right there. So the go land. All right. Check this guy. Same party time. Off the advertisement. All right, I'm gonna try this one more time. What's going Pretty on? Sure, now that I got a good rhythm, I can do it. Here we go. I'm gonna do this. Ooh. All right. Here we go. I'm pretty sure we already saved this one. So I'm gonna do it again. Before I give you guys, uh, all right, all right, guys. Well, you guys saw that that really wasn't that easy compared to the first level. You guys, let me know down in the comment section below what you guys thought of Sword of Zolan. So, in the Sword of Zolan, what's pretty interesting, you had to actually go instead of uh, ghouls and goblins or ghosts and goblins or whatever. There's a lot of those. Um, you capture, you get to capture one person at the end of the game. This one you have to save three or four. And you have to defeat different enemies like 
mummies and bats and you got to find the actual people in the different hidden areas which was cool and you got to collect the different potions to shoot which I thought was really neat that game at first it was kind of slow but then once you get into it, it was really super awesome and rocking so I'll also put a link down in the description below for that that way you guys can uh, download it it's pretty cool and by the way when I'm doing uh, product reviews from developers from Google Play they are not sponsoring these episodes which if they want to in the future they can but they're not it's just they're games that I really really enjoy also the products that I showcase on my show none of them sponsor me whatsoever but if you guys are out there and you're listening and you want to sponsor me I won't complain you guys could do it so anyway you guys do me a favor and watch my videos every Wednesday every Saturday 8 a.m. California time and you guys hit that notification bell that tells you every time I make a video and you guys like comment and share as well the more ways we can get this out the better so it's all for you guys and entertainment purposes that way you guys can see the better version of me and I can see the better version of you guys sharing it to your friends and you guys have a wonderful wonderful day